Welcome to this Figma tutorial on designing progress bar. Today we'll be creating a progress bar components and then duplicate it into different states for animation. And here is a preview of our final result. All right, let's get started. Before we jump into this tutorial, let me tell you about Master UI Plus. It's the ultimate Figma design system with over 200 interactive components. You can create amazing user interfaces in no time. Just drag and drop to get fully interactive components in your prototypes. And the best part, you can get 40% off if you click the link in the description. All right, let's get back to our tutorial. Here we go create a new design file and rename it to progress bar then go and pick the rectangle tool and let's draw a rectangle of 300 pixel width by 15 pixel that's great now let's add a border radius of 10 pixels then uh, duplicate the shape tool command c and command v and let's pick the right side and move it to the left let's make it with 50 pixels and change its fill color to a bright green all right next select those two rectangles and create new component and then create a new variance select the components frame and let's go to property setting and rename that to steps and the first one will be step one the second step two and let's select the green shape and let's increase its size to 100 and then select the second variance and add new one and select the green and move it to the center 150 pixel and rename it to step 3 all right let's add another variant and select the green shape let's move it to let's say 220 pixel of width again one last time new variant step 5 that will be step 4 and with the last one make our green shape to fill all its container and now select my component can rename the component to progress bar and let's go to prototype and connect the first step with the second step and in action let's pick after delay one millisecond and smart animate the second step with the third step right after delay one millisecond and smart animate the third step with the fourth step after delay one millisecond and then the fifth step the fifth step and after delay one millisecond and make sure it is smart animate all right now create a new frame and go to asset and drag our progress bar inside the frame go to the design tab and center horizontal and vertical now select the frame and hit the play button here we go we have our animation of the progress bar thanks for joining me for this tutorial you can find the download link to the exercise file of this tutorial in the description down below and if you are looking for more interactive components, then you should check out Master UI Plus. Everything you need will be at your fingertips when it comes to interactive components. And this will make your design process faster and more efficient. And one last thing, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video.